guys, so this is your Harry, we're on Ad Iron Looper, and um, today we're going to talk about um, my next book that's coming out soon called Sea Protection and the Power of Growing Your Hair Long, Two Powerful Health Protocols. So, Dave, you heard about Sea Protection? Don't know much about that really, yep. But I've definitely heard about growing your hair long, definitely. Have you? Yeah. Can you tell us again, what is your opinion on that? Yeah, I don't know. It's not something I'm going to do myself. But it does make sense, isn't it? That, like you said, the sunlight is good. Your skin absorbs and the, the good stuff, you long hair as well. So, yeah, can you tell me about that? It's not something I know much about. Yeah, well, um, I heard it in the Facebook community um, about two or three years ago, and it made sense to me because I'm the story of Samson and Delilah. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Samson yeah. lost his powers when Delilah cut his hair. But also, it goes further because we think about the Sikhs. The Sikhs were a holy warrior race yeah. of people, they were real warriors. I got a friend of mine who's a Sikh. And does he wear a turban? Never, yeah, no, he's stopped now, oh. his father's, sorry. Okay, so his father wears a Yeah, there's three things, isn't it, to be a Sikh. You never cut your hair, yeah. you wear a turban, and you've always got a knife on you. Oh. They're the only people legally allowed to carry a knife. Wow. Everywhere they go, 100%, they've got a knife on them, a little knife. And that makes sense, because they literally were a warrior race of yeah, people. So that's, right. that, that's like a tradition they're carrying on. Because yeah. so, and they believe, the Sikhs, that their yeah. warrior, their strength came from the growing their hair long, which yeah. makes complete sense with what I feel and we know in the communities that your hair is power, it's definitely like your spiritual antenna, because you think about the Native Americans, yeah, an right? Yeah. The Native Americans, they had long hair, yeah. and they were said to be able to um, listen on the ground for many miles for horses. And Interesting, yeah. They yeah, had yeah. lots of powers, and also their intuition um, with uh, being bad people, psychopaths, and um, the white right. man was very strong. So I feel like growing your hair has does definitely have superpowers to it, and I feel much more energetic too. That's a whole different topic too. It gives you... I believe that, that long hair converts to sunlight into energy. Right. So it goes very deep and increases your health as one thing. So it's, yep. it's a spiritual thing for intuition, it's also a health thing, it's also an energy thing. It's um Because Samson was probably the strongest man ever lived, but the dumbest man ever lived, so he was stupid. Well yeah, to let your woman um, three, three yeah, times, okay. three times he said, Tell me, what's the secret of your spring? And he said, Oh, if you do this and this and this and he was another third time, you're teasing me. I'm not going to do anything. It wasn't me who told the Philistines. Tell me, what's the secret of your strength? Yeah. Okay, cut my hair. Yep. So stupid. And, and I feel but, like that's true because like, it's, the Bible has lots of little stories like that, yeah. like little tales. And there's yeah. a really deeper meaning behind that, which, right. which most people don't think about. And it's, it's not like a joke. It's like it's literally you cut your hair and you have another thing. Really is, have the, the army too. Mm. The army, they make you cut your hair. Yeah. It's like more quality, but I think it's more just more quality. Yeah. It's more like we're going to take your power away from you. Yeah. And yeah, but I just feel like it's something that I've done, I've obviously my hair's not long now, I've done six months here in Portugal and then I cut it uh, for money and then I'm going to regrow it now for a year or two and I, I don't years. Yeah, I'm going to see what it's like. And, it's, and do you wash your hair with only water? Well, I'm sorry. last night I did it just during on yeah. it. Um, last night, so it doesn't smell today, I don't think. I right, no, yeah. Well, so, yeah, I do. Because um, they do it. say, if you don't put any chemicals on it at all, you grow it long, yeah. you'll naturally grow into thread. Naturally, really? yeah. Oh, I love that when mine goes long, it goes really curly, that's what my natural state is, right. and I love it. And I suppose everybody's different. Yeah. Yeah. There is one not issue, but what people have to realise with long hair is it, it's, for guys, it's hard to maintain. Um, I know my friend Lee's been growing for five years, right. and it's, it's, you have to look after it, so you have to make, untangle it every week, so it's not like a big See, that thing. wouldn't get red lots of No. I think. No, no. If you just like, live wild, mm. don't do anything, you'll naturally have long red lots. And I suppose your beard as well, but that would take decades. Yeah, well, but the, beard grows, the beard grows pretty quick, I think. Yeah, yeah. quicker than that does, so that's, that's, not, that's an easy You've one. probably got high testosterone in it as well. Yeah, I think Everything. so. Fingernails, yeah. toenails, it's all growth hormone, testosterone. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. And, and the testosterone, yeah. age, urine, urine therapy, wow. If you look your urine, you're in all there, isn't it? Yeah. I learned something about your cells now, different subject, but well, similar. Yeah. Every human loses about 3,000 cells every second. Oh. Now, how much... That, that's dying, like right? your cells die. But your body's making new stem cells about that much. Obviously more if you grow. Like a child has to make a lot more than they lose, isn't it? Right. But how many is in your body? Like per, I, I don't know. Uh, what, kids will have loads. Yeah, loads. Said, yeah. Like, even us, we have loads. Yeah. And because we're healthy too, I think yeah. we're more than that healthy person. Um, so if you're losing 3,000 a second, and you loop all your organs, yeah. you're putting that back in, aren't you? You're putting the good, or good cells back in stem cells. And then of course, I don't know if you've been on during, I feel like it, yeah. it's, people say that it multiplies the Yeah, cells. that makes sense to me. I yeah. feel like that's true. Like, yeah. So you're talking about ridiculous amount of stem cells when yeah. it ages for a couple of weeks and a couple of months. So yes, yeah, so, um, stem what cells... What I'd really like to know about things, all right, does it take you out of capacity state? Uh, my opinion is, and I, I'm like you, I want yeah. to know, my opinion is it pushes you deeper 
her into a faster state without being able to decide faster. That would be like, it takes you to another level. Like, I'm sure it's taking her in math. Yeah, yeah. Maybe the age of injury means a bit too much. I wonder, yeah. Like, 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 I got the hang of it. I love it. I love yeah. it. Yeah. Um, pain stuff. Very great. Sometimes the pain. I like. Uh, I, I do like the pain sometimes. Like, yeah. It's a strong yeah. feeling, isn't it? It's strong. And you do aids or um, pulling? You think you can pull it? Yeah. Um, I do. Uh, um, lately, I've been doing a lot of pain under the tongue. Good. Because I found that that goes really deep into circulation and that yeah. digestion. Yeah. That's really good. And I, I do my teeth sometimes. If I don't brush my teeth, I just go and gobble my mouth. Yeah. And yeah. Was it you that I did a video where, yeah, I think it was you yeah. that did. You, you did aged orange on your mouth. A lot. And you pulled out white stuff. On yeah, your... a lot. I did it a lot. <laughs> yeah, I remember the video. That but it was, was like, like really old stuff, really powerful. Oh. Oh, I was good for seven years old. Wow. My first one was being ever aged. That was shocking. I said that to people and it was yeah. like, but it really does. Did it burn your mouth? It yeah, like, it did burn. Yes. And I was like, what's that coming up? There's something in my mouth. Oh, it's the skin. Yeah. So it takes a top plate. Maybe a fraction of a millimetre off him. Yeah. That's going to be clean, isn't it? It's so it, clean. It, literally, there must have been toxins, I guess. Yeah, it must be, yeah. You literally pulled out. Yeah. I certainly had pain. When I eat massively foods, raw yeah. foods, I get told a lesson. Because if I do the goggling with age for an arm, for instance, six months old, my yeah. mouth burns, just as it probably burn with you. Right. So there, there's a feedback system there. If it burns a lot, you might have. So what do you yeah. think is the best diet then? What is the best food you oh. have? That's a, that's a good question. Yeah. Um, good Lord. It's a big of a, like, in the whole community, a lot of people are just strictly fruit and eat, you only eat fruit. Right. And I understand that. I understand that too. Because it's Adam and Eve, of course, who are designed to eat fruit. Then yeah. Every tree of the garden they can eat. But I think after the rebellion and eat, after sin, and then after the flood, Noah's flood, yeah. we were okay to eat animals. In fact, God instructed his place to eat animals on the Passover. We slaughter the animal, we eat it. That would, you know, so... That's interesting. You so have to I wonder why like, animals are here. Yep. I mean, I'm with you that fruits are really good for detoxification. I know that yep. for a fact. But my concern with eating fruits 100%, if I'm being honest with you guys, is how do you maintain a good weight on yeah. um, something that's constantly detoxifying you? Do you want to be in a constant state of detoxification? Interesting. And, and like a skeleton? Because yeah. I've been there. I mean, you probably know people have been there. So Everybody is a fruitarian. It's just it's thin and weak looking, do not they? Yeah, that's if you're my, only If yeah. you're only fruit, yeah. you can never get a strong, healthy looking yeah. fruitarian. Right. I, I think it's, it's okay for all the, the masses that are sick to do di go diet because it's so healthy. Yeah, yeah. They should do four or five months intensive because they're doing so much toxins. Yeah. But if you're already healthy like us and doing the abuse to your own these protocols, yeah. I don't know. Because I know you have to build and like, you want to do gardening and yeah. proper manage sure. it. I don't know how you're going to do it 100% diet on the rest of your life. I think, mean, especially for a man. Yeah. For a woman, it's okay you know, to look really thin and it's a feminine, isn't it? Yeah, I've even heard, I've even heard that sugar lowers your testosterone levels. Yeah, even I would agree. Sugar. Yeah. So, you can't stay know. a good sugar fruit. That's right. You're lowering your testosterone levels. Like, this is why men who have done food here for a long time look feminine and weak. Yep. Yeah, I think you can eat a bit of seafood and a bit I of I think vegetables animal. are key there. But yeah, vegetables, yeah. Meat too. But meat's definitely good meat. meat. I'm open-minded to experiments. Yeah. I definitely don't judge people what they do, and I've got to, you can only know from your experiments with these products, with these other diets. What you do, I also subscribe a little bit to everyone's diet. I've got that in my mind too. Everyone's diet is different. Yeah, Everyone's you find what works for you. Yeah. Find what works for you. Exactly. My thing is, I just like real food. Yeah. Something you recognise as a real food, and it doesn't have a list of ingredients or no ingredients. It is just that food. Yeah. So it could be cows, pig, sheep, lamb, you know, apple. Whatever, you know. Not That's why right, someone's calling it. That's right, not factory files. Yeah. It's an interesting debate, for sure. Definitely. So, it was a list of Harry with Omad Horror and Looper. Um, going all over the place, we're talking about some good stuff. I hope you got some value from Harvey. Dave, I hope.